Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves out in Montana with a fairly uh, new frauditor that goes by the name of Paladin Press. And uh, this guy apparently has a few screws loose as he attempts to uh, film on privately owned property and ends up getting trespassed. Oh, what a dumbass this one is. So let's go and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. What's up, y'all? Welcome to another edition of Paladin Press. I'm Jeff Rowe. Today, November 30th, 2023, we are in Kalispell, Montana. If you filmed this in November, then why the hell did you wait so long to upload this onto YouTube? Because you just uploaded it yesterday. Were you afraid that somebody would come along and rip your arguments to shreds? Because from what I've already seen, your arguments are, well, pretty much ill-formed and totally moronic to begin with. But hey, uh... You're only learning, as you said uh, at some point in the video. So maybe you'll learn to do a lot better and maybe not, uh, well, try to be such a douchebag. But I doubt it. I really do doubt it. We are traveling to the Driver Services Bureau as we are on the worldwide tour of America's historical buildings and other public gathering places. Let's roam. Sounds like you've taken up the same premise of Amagansett Press that you're making travel videos. Uh, uh, at least uh, Amagansett Press knows how to make it look a little bit more legitimate because he doesn't actually try to enter the business he's harassing. Well, you do. Now, notice this sign right here. He's going to try to use this with the security guard later on to say that he's filming for his own security in this office. I mean, good freaking grief, dude. I mean, come on now. If you feel unsafe in there and have to be safe and secure with your camera, then go somewhere else because the security cameras in that office are meant to make sure that dumbasses don't come in there and uh, try to steal people's information, which is one thing that uh, you're apparently trying to do because, well, there are privacy booths in there that you will see later on, uh, which basically means that they're trying to keep some information confidential. So that's one thing to look out for, are those privacy booths, which he says he didn't see. Yeah, yeah, and how is uh, taking this shutter camera right here and you taking all sorts of still images of potentially uh, you know, sensitive personal information from across the room uh, uh, beneficial to your security? That's what I'm wondering right here. I mean, don't piss on my leg and tell me it's raining. I mean, come on now, dude, be a little bit more intelligent than that. Oh, well. Let me know when you're done with that. Now you're going to go next. 
to sign your name. Sir, have you been helped? Oh, uh, appointment only, right? Yeah, there's a lady up here at the front. She just walked All right. out. I'll make an appointment. Okay. Hello, how are you doing? Can I help you? Sure. What's your your Nancy? Yeah. Your your greeter. So name tag says. Okay. What can Hi. I help you oh, with? just just greet me. Okay. I'm assisting with another guest right now. Oh, per okay. Go ahead and do that before you okay. greet me then. But I greet I me eventually. If I could have you stay out here. Oh. Yeah. 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 Sure. Can I have you go back out in the lobby, please? Sure. I mean, is that about it? Lobby? No, no the lobby's out there. Here? Oh, past mm -hmm. this line here? Or where, 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 where's the line? Just out here, behind okay. the end of the line here. Sure. Excuse me. Oh, I didn't know that. Well, since, since somebody that does want to be on camera to ask me that. What, what are you taking pictures of, sir? Just trying to kindly and politely, quietly take pictures of anything I can see in the public area. Okay. Which, um, yeah. Oh, oh, so you think it's appropriate to come in here into a DMV and start uh, taking pictures of uh, everybody in there with a... Uh, potentially confidential information in there, making it easier for identity thieves on the internet to uh, uh, pretty much catch that data on camera. I mean, dude, you're not exactly helping keep the identity theft down. In fact, I'm sure you are on the identity thieves side at this point. They did. They just sent me to the lobby. I, I, that I, is the lobby. Oh, ah, at what line? I don't know. I'm in the lobby. Hey, you can't be taking photos? No. No. Yeah, come on up. It says it right on the wall. No, come on up, oh, yeah, yeah. I don't want to yeah, distract. All right. Uh, sure, I've been compliable. I'm compliable. That's why I get in trouble, right? It says it right here. What's it say? It's, it's in. It's, no, the, theirs are in use, not yours. <laughs> theirs are in use. What? Yeah, that's what them. They're saying. Thank yeah, you. They're letting you know you're being recorded. Is what they're telling you. Yeah. Video and audio surveillance are in use on this premise for security purposes. So they're could I have? On. I can have security too. Well, you can, but they're not supposed to film it. I'm just letting you know. Yeah. Just letting you know. Though. I don't want you getting in trouble. Okay. You can't do it in here either because it's social security office. I'm to understand that I can at least do it in the you lobby can do it. area. Yes, you certainly can. Yes. No, in the lobby Not area. In there, it's this, this says, is leased. This is leased. Beyond this door is a leased federal office. Right, right, right. Yeah. So in here, you out here you can, but not inside. I can't. Even I've I've read it before. I, I have too, and it's like eh, it's kind of clear as mud. The funny thing is, I've been googling some of my questions lately, and Google is actually very. But I would be careful what you listen to and watch because you never know. Oh, I know, yeah, but, but uh, I, mean, I know in here I I got in trouble once. So let's check out this sign. Yeah, right here. Yeah, I'd be careful with actually Googling the question itself because you could come up with all sorts of dumbass answers, which is why we probably have a lot of dumbasses like you walking around because that kind of information can be easily corrupted. Let's just look up the term quote mining and you'll understand. Best thing you can do is look up the laws of anything you're told about and uh, ask for citations and everything like that because if they don't provide you with citations then most likely they're not a credible source and if they do provide you with citations make sure they're not 
uh, quote mine because you get that from time to time. But please, let's carry on with your stupidity. Let's hear the other half ass lame arguments that you are going to come up with. Then we'll skip ahead to when the uh, cops show up. You know, Good. thanks, thanks, you thanks. Let me step over. Here, I, yeah, get a I, I got in trouble myself because somebody was in here taking photos. This is where you take in. I've read it, you know. Yeah, I mean, I, I've seen it too. So I'd kind of like to. I think it might be in the offices. Yeah. So right. so law, right. Prohibited. This whole thing is the right here. This beyond is all leased office. Then I think they would call it the SSA a office well, it, as a whole. Yeah, I think See they that, call it. Yeah. You no, know, they're talking about each individual office for each employee back there. But the if if they were talking about the whole thing being an office, yeah. No, no, no. I I assure you. I am allowed to be in there and take pictures no, right I, there. I assure you, you're not. I'm just telling you, you're not. Oh, I don't. I don't yeah. want to fight you no, about it, either. physically or <laughs> arguably or yeah, otherwise. No, you, okay, okay, everybody. You know that is a social security office. I wonder what makes him uh, believe that uh, he's actually allowed to film inside of a social security office because you do have a bunch of confidential information that's out there in that office right there. I mean, come on now, dude. Are you that freaking stupid that you think you can just actually walk into office space that has a bunch of confidential information like that in it? I mean, come on now, dude. You're risking the... uh security of everybody in that building by doing what you're doing. But of course, like any frauditor, you don't have sim any empathy for anybody else but yourself. You have no concept of what empathy is. So from this point on, he's just going to have a bunch of circular arguments and everything like that. So let's just uh, go ahead and skip to the part where uh, the police trespass his sorry ass. Three hours later. Can you move it along? I'm all out of time cards. Alright, what was your first name again? Jeffrey. Jeffrey. And what's your first name? It's Officer Rose. So this is okay, Jane, she's the building manager. Mm -hmm. Okay, and she wants you trespass from the building. At this point. Did you explain to her what I explained to you? Which you yeah, she did not it, give me a so chance to explain. A, this is a private building, privately owned. But you yeah. know how that super is superseded okay. now. And they also want you trespass. You were in there filming, apparently. But that nothing. And that's sensitive information. Again, we're we're dealing with the same thing as the last exactly. week. Exactly, and it's sensitive information. They don't allow cameras in there. Okay, they don't want you filming other people's information. And then I'm being told that you're trying to get into offices no break rooms back are you kidding me I just I, I there's no clear signage that would say that distinguishes that but they did say something about waiting in the lobby i was like is it right here i see some lines on the floor i was like okay maybe i pass this line is into the lobby so i stayed across at least that line because they wouldn't define so i had to assume that this is the lobby they were talking about i went to that lobby okay. you yeah. know hey, just like sorry i'm gonna get a little heated because i don't want to give you trespassed again you this time you are from at least not from there i understand no, you're trying your best but did you even try to explain what i explained to you like this this citizen feels he said to me this she is the general may, manager may, of the building may i explain to her then exactly because because these these three buildings including irs and that office at least four offices in your private building have public offices in there these these and which makes all these hallways public no it doesn't include, make the hallways public it uh, makes the entryway to each of those but not all of the hallways. so how can i get to those well, at entry point points cannot, without because you didn't ask to begin with you took pictures of my daughters who were working. You took pictures of other people in this building who don't want anything to do with it. It's private care. You don't have the right to come in. And it's do it's that. a it's 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 a quandary. But how is it a quandary, dumbass? The building is privately owned and it's leasing the office space to government agencies, which host sensitive information, dude. In addition, these may be government agencies but they're still le uh, getting leased private property which still makes it private property so what is so difficult about that to understand because you do have sensitive information you do have private property issues what is so difficult to understand is your brain that uh 
it's the malformed that you can't figure that out. But but, but because you're because you're renting to you're renting to the public you're renting to the right. government you're renting to me. But, all right, whatever, whatever. I, it's, and they, so am I do, again? Do I have to leave under threat of arrest today? Am I going to be arrested? Or you want to put that because you know what? I messed up last time. I didn't I didn't dot all my eyes and my teeth. But I'm I will be getting a little tired of this. Okay. I mean, I'm trying to explain to you that. Um, and I, I I'll probably card, I probably have to call your supervisor. Have your I uh, bother Sergeant Bain then because okay. doesn't. So listen, because he knows better. Hey, Jeffrey. He he knows, yeah. and he'll have to tell you. She was going to get a business card if you wanted, so because you can't come back here. So if you need Driver Services Bureau, she said you can go to Helena, Polson, Missoula. You can go to another office. You're not welcome back at this one either. So whether you think it's public or not, they don't. Yeah. Want I want, yeah. Okay. Well, so I'm kind of the messenger right now. I'm letting you know. I want to be back today. I'm if I, I need to go see Sergeant Bain down at the office or somewhere. Sergeant or talk Bain to is not working today. You can go find some other supervisor. Sergeant Struble is working today. If you want to talk. Well, to don't him. don't don't set. The city or or the for, for a lawsuit that's technically what this does not that i even have the time or willpower yeah. to go through that but come on maybe here. i will though you're good out here just don't go in this building again, okay oh i'm good out here well see to a point this is private property this whole parking so, lot so so i haven't been is, i would just leave so i can't use the irs which i didn't need to use tomorrow i wanted to make an appointment you have to call and make an appointment they so don't let you so fine so with an appointment i can come here now well, and i'm, I'm not she, trespassed so she can speak if, with them yeah if, they say, hey, we got Jeffrey coming in for an appointment tomorrow. And we far. know he's trespassed. Yep. I will say, in this instance, he may come in. Do you see how this works out with these government offices? This is all public property. Okay. We're, we're, it's not public property. Can we Google it? Can you guys no. try to informate? I, I, I can guarantee you it is not public property. You can, I could do it on my phone right now if I had a hand free. Okay, Jeffrey. Guys, I'm leaving. I'm, I'm, my bicycle's okay. around back. Can I walk on the sidewalk around the back? Am I, no, you're not filming people. What? And if I don't leave, then you could be arrested. Can, could, or could, yeah. could, or you will do it. I could arrest you. I could cite you, which is technically an arrest. I don't want to do it. I'm telling you to move along today. And this one's going to go on, a, on your record that you're being trespassed. Okay? You're certainly welcome to call supervisors, call the agency, whatever. If you have Who's your sergeant today? If it's, okay. if it's not Bain. Scru Scruble? Yep. So Sergeant Scruble's working. Okay. Lieutenant Peterson's in. Captain of the Fat Fight. Chief. Any of them. You can go talk to one of them. Okay. Can I have this trespass in writing this time? Because last time, like I said, you didn't actually trespass me last time. You're yeah, saying... Your global jacket. Nothing was added to my global jacket. It's That's really added this, added time, this time, it's, it's really going to happen? Yep. It's a real trespass. And, and, under, and if I don't leave, you will... Do what? Okay. Jeffrey. All right. Go. Just go. So I need your information that way I can put in an email to my bureau chief okay. and my regional. And if he's being trespassed here in his building, he would have to go to a different office. Okay. Once they review the email and the information, they will make the decision if he needs to go specifically to the Helena office to have any services completed, yeah. or he can go to Pulse and one of the other offices. Can I get this in writing? Nope. You just got told. Where, where's my work? So I got to go get my jacket. Go get to my. Go find my jacket to find this trespass. So you just recorded it. You're good. No, no, that's what you did to me a couple weeks ago. You trespassed me. You're acting like you're getting tired of being trespassed. Well, maybe you shouldn't be doing things that get you trespassed. It's that freaking simple. Don't act like a dumbass with the people and uh well you will be welcome back but if you want to act like a complete douche canoe then well expect to be trespassed i mean come on now dude it's that simple well maybe not for simpletons such as yourself but at any rate guys i hope you enjoyed the video thanks for watching and i will see you on the next one Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube.
the Shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's... Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?